Good day everyone. Good day guys, we've made it here to the old Stewart Highway about 30 k's north of Catherine. Yes, yeah, so we just spent the last episode exploring Catherine and essentially the south side of Catherine. Yeah. And now we've come only a 30 minute drive up to this beautiful free camp to uh, explore the northern side of Catherine I guess you would say. Yeah, we're going to have a look at Edith Falls I think and yeah, see what else we can find but yeah, so the really cool thing about this spot as well is that it's super close to the Edith Falls turnoff. I think it's actually only like 1k. And because it's so close, it means that it's pretty easy to still duck back into Catherine if we need to do anything or we want to go back to the hot springs or go back to the national park or whatnot. Yeah. So we're sort of just going to chill out here for the next couple of days while I have to work and then we'll see what we get up to. We will. This spot's a ripper though. It's on, I'm not sure what river it's called, but um, beautiful clear flowing water there's a bit, a bit sandy around here so you've got to just be a bit careful of where you drive and whatnot some of the spots are a bit easier and harder to get into but um and we're not too sure about swimming here there's been a few i've seen a few photos of people swimming so yeah on wiki camp and a few people swimming up the river today but where we are, it gets a little bit deeper, a little bit murkier, so I don't... So this might be the last video you see of us. <laughs> That's what we're saying. We're, uh, we keep forgetting, we keep saying we need to buy a blow-up kiddie pool. It's quite hot today, about 35. It's been 35 all day type thing, so... Yeah. <laughs> I mean all day. It's been about 35 all week we've been here, so it's pretty constant. It does cool off at night time, which is nice though. Yeah. Beautiful evenings. And first thing in the morning, it's really, really nice. Yeah. But we're just gonna have some lunch first. So we're gonna have some of our, we've just been and done the grocery shopping before we left Catherine. So, so we're got, fully stocked. Fully stocked. We've got some fresh bread rolls and we're gonna have that with some uh, of the leftover lamb from our beautiful dinner in Catherine, which we've got in last last week's video. You can check that, that out. Um, and yeah, I'm just making a little bit of tabbouleh to go with that, since tabbouleh goes best with lamb. Beautiful. Oh well, thanks for watching guys. We'll see what we get up to in this episode. how many bats there are. No, but last night was all good. There wasn't as many as the first night we were there. No. So we're not sure why. We did have a fire going last night. We don't know whether that kept the bats away a bit more, but... Fingers crossed. It is pretty cool to see, but it's also not great for the car and the caravan to have that poop all over it. We're lucky that we're camped by a creek, so it's pretty easy to wash the car and caravan. We've got no shortage of water. Speaking of water, this afternoon, because it's stinking hot, we're going to check out Edith Falls. Well, we've still got a bit of daylight this Arvo. We're going to drive out, we're going to have a look and a bit of a swim. I think I've been spoiled by the hot springs the last couple of weeks. Back to reality. Yeah. There's no hot springs out here. No, no hot springs. But we'll still have a look, see what it's all about and uh, cool off a little bit.
a hard card. Now. What? Our return. So half hour. What? Well, we're only going here once. Mitch won't do this twice. Too far to walk. We were getting there. Bit of a bushfire out over the back there. I'm not actually sure how far it is to the pool, do you know? I don't know either. I, I saw the loop was 2.6k if you go all the way around. Mm. But I'm not exactly sure how far from the car park to the upper pool. No, I quickly glanced at the signs and I saw four hour return or something. Uh, and we're not doing that one. <laughs> and I assume that's not us. <laughs> it's, uh, I'm a bit worried about my thongs breaking to be honest. Uh, well, <laughs> must be nearly there. We're just around the next corner up there. We'll see. It's a pretty easy walk, not too bad. It's a bit steep going up some steps, but it's pretty good overall. I know, everything's hot here. Lake, isn't it? Which one are we going to? Just the one just in here. We must be nearly there because it doesn't even tell you how far it is in. So it's 9.30 so we're a third of the way. Beautiful. Through there. Yeah, it is a pretty stunning view. I'd say you see more along the walk though. The little lookout that's just before the turn off to the upper pools. It's a little bit overgrown so you can't really see a good look but you can just see a little bit of the lower pools, which is pretty nice. It looks good after walking all the way up here. There's like three ponds, well it looks one, two and then three up over the back if you can. Gotta walk down there now I think. Not too far to go. Oh, she's flowing crystal clear, isn't she? She's magical, isn't it? What are you complaining about? It's not Madarinka or Catherine. It's a bit cold here. Jump in, quick. You're on film. <laughs> Really nice, doesn't it? What? Down in there. 
Oh, there's a big fish there too. Yeah. Oh, it's a big one, Rochelle. It's a big one. Yeah. About that long. Yeah. yeah. Nah. It's actually a lizard. Oh. Mate, he can swim. Here he comes. Here he comes. He's long as. I've got to get my feet in the water. They're burning. Oh, he is an absolute ripper. You have to zoom in on him, Rochelle. No, it's not. No. No, that's how deep it is. How deep it is. Oh, yeah, it's okay. Yeah. Yeah, it's definitely okay. Oh, it's really warm. So Mitch decided we weren't going to head back the way we came. We were going to take the goat track back. No, we're doing the full loop track. Full loop track. It's a goat track, I'm telling you. It's the map on the thing down. It's a Llewellyn Lookout loop track. That's the middle pool down there. Look how full. Oh my goodness. Oh. There's a big waterfall there too. Okay, it was worth it. That's a pretty spectacular view. I think that's actually the best view that we've had on the whole time out here. That's Becky. Wow. Waterfall. This would be a ripper look out. Yes! <laughs> what? Yeah, this is the actual where people get the shot. This is the shot. This is the shot. Look at that. It's up the top there, that's just where we were swimming. And then that down there is the middle pond, which we were overlooking on that wall. Mm -hmm. 